Hello Virgo, welcome to your he said, she said spread. This is for the week beginning July 1st, 2018. Say hello to Richard. Hello Virgo. Now don't forget we've got our uh, special on the he said, she said personals. It's $35 for a 20 minute reading. For that you'll get uh, both Richard and I uh, uh, giving our insight into your personal situation. So if you'd like one of those please email me gypsyinsights at gmail.com. Now let's get along with your reading here Virgo. From Le Vampire you've pulled the card of knowledge which is study, learning, education. And from the energy oracle you've pulled the card of yin and yang in the upright. Now knowledge of course is speaking about uh, the need for to keep continue learning through life. You may be considering going back to school or you may even be in a course of study at the present time. Now yin and yang in the upright heralds a yin cycle where most of the action seems to be happening under the surface of things. It's a time of great receptivity, intuition and gestation. External circumstances may be forcing you to go within and examine present activity. It's an especially good time for completion to wrap things up. So you may be wrapping up some kind of study at the present time. And uh, yin cycles often call you to be yielding, reflective, being more than acting. So let's see where this goes. I feel more so it's, it's about completing something here. I feel it's some kind of learning experience. So we'll see where this goes for you, Virgo. Let's get some energies for Virgo for the week beginning July 1st, 2018 for Virgo. What are the energies for Virgo? Energies for Virgo for the week beginning July 1st, 2018. The first card will signify your partner or your potential partner's energy. The, uh, what they bring to the table or their uh, attributes, the flaws, how they feel about you, how you feel about them, the strengths in the relationship, the weakness of the relationship, the potential for a healthy relationship crossed by any roadblocks and the outcome. So let's have a look and see what the energy is of your partner or potential partner. Virgo, we have the Hermit in reverse. So this is someone coming out of a period of withdrawal, isolation, getting back out there, becoming more uh, social I feel. Maybe after a period of time where they've had to go within, be uh, go through a period of uh, self-analysis. Now let's have a look at the uh, the attributes or what they bring to the table. The seven of swords in reverse. So they want to they want to come clean here. They want. Uh, they I feel that they may have done something in the past here. Yeah, confession. Yeah, it is about confession, isn't it? Someone who wants to do the right thing. There may have been some kind of past betrayal. Uh, I feel that, that now though, I feel that they, they want to make things right. Now let's have a look and see what their flaws are. The Five of Pentacles. So I feel as a flaw here, they may have rejected you, Virgo, in the past and uh, may have uh, betrayed you in some way but I feel the energy now with this person is they want to come back around after a period of withdrawal from you. So let's see how this person is viewing you Virgo. The Page of Cups, so they want that new beginning with you, that fresh start Vitality, get a lot of vitality out of that. A lot of youthful enthusiasm here, mm. wanting to get things going, but starting again, I feel, more so with this card. Now let's see how you're viewing them. Virgo, with the Nine of Wands in reverse, I feel like you are, you may be giving up on this situation. You may feel too tired, exhausted to keep keep going here. Especially if there's been some sort of betrayal. Let's have a look at the strengths between you two. 
and we have the page of pentacles in reverse now as a strength here I, I feel that the page of pentacles is a card of the student of someone who is uh, willing to learn to put in the effort here to uh, to get something started and I feel that as a strength here you you want to learn that there's very much an energy here of putting the focus in being goal oriented as well I'm picking this up as a some kind of learning experience that you've gone through here Virgo let's have a look at the weaknesses the knight of swords in reverse so nobody is making a move here there's a, a feeling of stagnancy with this card not taking any kind of action to complete something here it also could indicate cruelty somebody who's not really in control <clears throat> of what they're doing right which would uh, go well with these cards here where I pick up I, I'm picking up that someone has done something here that they're not proud of they're looking for a new start with you Virgo but I feel that you don't really want to go there your focus I feel may be on you may be trying to focus on getting something started here for yourself it, it, I'm picking it up as a course of study but it, it could also be a learning experience a, a new job something that is just just getting started right now but I feel that your focus is, is elsewhere and there's no the weakness of the relationship I feel is that there's no movement to get this back together even though I feel that this person may be wanting that now let's have a look at the healthy the, the chance for a healthy relationship the eight of pentacles in reverse and it's crossed by the three of swords so there's no chance here absolutely no chance that there, there's an unwillingness to put in the effort right and it's crossed by an ending here it could be a third party situation but I pick up uh, that happened in the past yeah, this, I, this betrayal here yeah I get that too uh, but I feel for you Virgo and I'm picking it up as you but it could be the other way around that, that your focus is very much on this study or this uh, learning experience here and, and, and I get that there's no effort being made to uh, get to get this back together right let's have a look at the outcome and the Empress in reverse so there's a sense with this card of feeling and a sense of uh, imbalance there's a lack of abundance around you feeling that you haven't achieved what you wanted let's see what this empress in reverse is we'll get some clarification oh okay now we've got the three of pentacles in reverse so this there's, there's a and the ace of cups so when it comes to to love here Virgo there's no teamwork here there's a, a lack of getting this back together I feel there may be an opportunity I feel that it's your partner here Virgo that may want this new start this this renewal here of love but I feel for you you want to focus on uh, getting your own stability here because I, I feel the, the sense I get with this card with the three of pentacles in reverse is that you, you're feeling that there is a lack of teamwork with this person I, I just get the sense it's just not worth your time right it, it certainly seems that way but uh, I feel like the other person wants to wants this fresh start but but you're not you're not interested at all here you're not having any of it no Let, let's get another card what's this ace of cups I want to get one more outcome card for Virgo yeah we've got the ten of swords you're putting an end to this that you're not interested I feel for you it, it's over it's finished and you're not interested in uh, in going back to this I feel for you it's very much a, 
it's been a learning experience I get that and, and but for you it, it's very much completion of this uh, situation and, and refocusing your energy on something here that I feel is going to be um, uh, provide a, a more greater opportunity here for you in the future you've already gone within you've made a decision so it's all about uh, moving on I think for you uh, you're, you're not interested in revisiting something here so I'm gonna leave it there for you Virgo and I wish you all the best at this don't forget we've got that he said she said uh, special which is $35 for 20 minutes for that you'll get a uh, recording of both Richard and I providing insight on your particular situation so you can email me gypsyinsights at gmail.com if you're interested in that and please don't forget to check out my channel Gypsy Insights by Michelle I have the in-depth readings there which I do twice monthly and uh, I've just put up the mid July so check those out they're brand new and don't forget to like share and subscribe so I wish you all the best Virgo and I'll see you next week goodbye and good luck Virgo